In the final game of the regular season, Hopkinton Hiller Boys Varsity Basketball took on Wayland. Jack Ionelli got the offense going for the Hillers. A little flat and then uh, refocused after an early timeout, and they were able to pull away after that. Here's a three-pointer for Jack Ionelli. Ionelli for three. Count it! Yeah, not waiting. Not waiting for... Uh, for the offense to get settled or the defense to get settled, just takes it right up. They're setting up in a 2-3 zone here, the Hillers. Oh, Ionelli with a big steal. Quick hands by Ionelli, and he finishes. Already eight points for yeah, Jack that, Ionelli. That's a quick eight points for him. Ross taking it up. Good steal there. Ionelli with the quick hands once again to the rack, and he gets the bucket. It was a 14-9 Hiller lead entering the second quarter and the Hiller offense picked up the pace even more. Trying to take it in, Caulfield up for the floater, no good, Ionelli grabs it. To Dedejan, Dedejan puts it up and in, Joe. Ionelli taking it in, squeezes between two defenders, gets it to Marcinowski, who banks it off the glass and in. Great assist by Ionelli on that play. There's a steal by Ionelli. Oh, look at that steal. Feeds it back and Dedejan finishes. Another assist by uh, Ionelli there. Cho gets it into Marcinowski. Up and in with the hook. Yeah, not, an easy, not as easy as it looked. A lot of body contact on Marcinowski there. Oh, Ionelli again. Count it. Wow, that's amazing. Just catches the steal right out of the, right out of the air. Quickest hands I think I've ever seen. Now Willitson for three. Got it! Hillers outscore Wayland in the second quarter, 21-11. to The Hillers had six different point scorers in the quarter. It was a 35-20 to Hillers lead at the half. During the halftime break, I had a chance to talk with members of the Hiller girls basketball team who were fresh off a win versus Tewksbury in a Westboro tournament consolation game. In case you missed it, here's the conversation. Hopkinton Hillers girls varsity basketball team. Uh, girls, introduce yourselves. Who do we have here? I'm Elena Davies, and I'm a senior. <laughs> I'm Kate Finnegan, and I'm also a senior. I'm Bethel Flanagan, and I'm also a senior. I'm Caroline Kane, and I'm also a senior. <laughs> All right, uh, so you just went to the Westboro tournament and uh, had a couple of good games against uh, Wayland and Tewksbury, got a nice win. Uh, how was the tournament, and how was that experience? It was really good. I mean, the Westboro tournament's always fun every year, nearing the end of the season, so we were looking forward to it this year, but it was a good couple games we had. Yeah, the Westboro tournament, it's just such a great atmosphere, and we all love going to it. Um, I think we played really hard, especially today, on offense and defense. It's good to get a tenth one. Yeah. Yes. Absolutely, uh, and it must feel good heading into the playoffs uh, with a win. Are you ready for the postseason? Yeah. Oh, yeah, we're so ready. Excited. <laughs> it's been a little bit, but we're excited to be back. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> all right, and I have to ask, uh, you're all captains, and I believe all in your senior year? Correct? Yes. So uh, what's your favorite uh, memory from uh, being uh, part of the Hiller girls basketball team? Oh, that's or a good question. There's a lot of good ones, but hmm, I think my favorite memory might be Honestly, senior night this year, although we didn't get the win that we wanted, it was still so much fun, like, doing all, like, the senior night activities, and it was crazy that it was finally, like, our turn to be the senior, so yeah. that was a lot of fun. All right. Um, mine was senior night last year, Bruce night. It was really <laughs> fun. It was just a great day to celebrate, Alexis. So. I've just enjoyed playing with these people forever. We've been <laughs> playing together since, like, fourth grade, so yeah. it's good to finally be together one last time. Absolutely. Yeah. I'd also say senior night and probably just like the spaggers with the team because like Bethel said, we've been so close and like it's so nice to share this bond and play one last time with everyone. Well girls, congratulations on a great season. We're looking forward to the playoffs and it's been fun uh, following all of you throughout your Hiller days. Thank, Thank you. you so much. It was a good back and forth battle in the third quarter. Underneath, kicks it out to Del Ponte. Will it sit? Ionelli, up for the shot, count it. Driving in, no good. Bat in the air, and it's collected by DeLuca. Up top, Cho for three, got it. Big bucket for Cho. Attempt, and it is off the top of the hoop. Rebound, Marcinowski off the missed Burke shot. 
DeLuca feeds it over, and now Willitson from the corner buries it. The Hillers had eight different point scorers in the third and outscored Wayland 20 to 18 in the quarter and led the game 55 to 38 heading into the fourth quarter. As they work around the perimeter, cross to Dedasia, now Willison from the corner, knocks it down, plus the foul. The rare and one on a three ball. Oh, wow, he's uh, gonna go up there for the four point play. Play by Whalen to get a guy loose down the lane, they just could not connect. Ianelli buries a three from the corner. The Hillers pulled away in the fourth quarter and got some of the backups in the game. Hopkinton took the win in their regular season finale over Wayland, 74 to 53. Jack Ionelli netted a team high 19 points in the game. Sam Dedajan and James Barsanowski also contributed 12 points each, and Cooper Willardson had 11 points in the Hiller victory. With the win, the Hillers finish the regular season at 17 wins and three losses. The Hillers now await the MIAA Division II playoff brackets to see when they play next. Wayland finishes their season with four wins and 16 losses. The MIAA playoff brackets and schedules were released this past weekend. Hiller Boys Basketball finished the regular season with a record of 17-3 and and captured the sixth seed and will host the winner of 38-seeded Hingham and 27-seeded Reading Memorial at a date and time to be determined. Stay tuned to our website, hkim.tv, for updates. Hiller Girls Basketball finished the regular season 10-10 and and captured the 24th seed and will visit ninth-seeded Quincy in the first round of the Division I playoffs. The game is scheduled for Friday, March 1st at 6.30 p.m. Hiller Boys Hockey finished the regular season 14-4-2 and, and captured the 18th seed and will visit 15th-seeded Mesconomet in the first round of the Division II playoffs. The game will take place Wednesday, February 28th at 7.45 p.m. at Valley Forum in Haverhill. Hopkinton Dover Sherborne Girls Hockey Co-op finished the season 5-12-4 and fell just short of the playoffs. Congratulations to the team and first-year head coach Chin on a great, very competitive season. Be sure to stay tuned to the HCAM website, hcam.tv, and our social media pages for the latest updates of Hopkinton Hillers playoff action.